stay-at-home jobs, the importance of keywords to your website, by Philpine, www.philreviewwebbizscams.info. This article is aimed at those that have decided to build their own website and are looking for genuine opportunities to make money from stay-at-home jobs. In this series of articles I will provide you with genuine information on the real opportunities that do exist to make money at home. This article looks at some of the do's and don'ts of using keywords to increase traffic to your website. Keyword density and placement are key factors in optimizing your articles and web pages for search engines. You have to place your keywords where they will be detected and recognized as keywords by the search engine spiders, so that your article will get a high ranking when someone searches for that keyword. What is a keyword? A keyword is a word or phrase that is placed in your article a number of times. When the search engine spider sees a word or phrase in several locations within your article, it will determine that your page may be useful to users that search for such a keyword. Do not over-optimize your articles. Please note that it is possible to over-optimize your articles for particular words, this is known as iWord stuffing. Google makes the following statement about this practice, keyword stuffing refers to the practice of loading a web page with keywords in an attempt to manipulate a site's ranking in Google search results. Filling pages with keywords results in a negative user experience, and can harm your site's ranking. Focus on creating useful, information-rich content that uses keywords appropriately and in context. So be very careful not to overload your article with too many keywords. Keyword Density Keyword density is how many times your keyword is placed in your article. For example, if you want to achieve a 4% keyword density in a 400-word article, you will need to have the keyword in your article exactly 16 times. Everyone has their own views about the optimum keyword density. You will have to determine which density is best for your articles. As long as you don't over-optimize and you are making sufficient profit from your rankings, then you can choose whatever keyword density you like. Keyword Density Spread Regardless of the keyword density you choose, keywords need to be placed strategically so that there are more at the beginning and end of an article, you can visualize this as an hourglass pattern. Placing keywords in the right place and having the right number of them, will greatly improve your chances of getting well-placed search engine results. Good results means more traffic, more traffic should translate into more money. Keep working at it, I wish you all the best with your stay-at-home jobs. Internet Marketing Mentoring Course Normally $1,995, Currently $1. See www.philreviewwebbizscams.info